Good afternoon, everyone, and thanks for, uh, for joining us as we close out another season of Blue Jackets hockey. A trying season, uh, a lot of expectations going in. Some of them were met, some of them weren't for various reasons. But I think when the dust has settled here and we've looked at what we went through and where we ended up at, there's a lot of very, very positive signs for this hockey club. Um, our record from December 1st on was 16 games over 500. Our goal scoring was better than anticipated. Our um, development of players as we try to evolve as a franchise was extremely satisfying in a lot of ways. Older players like Nick Foligno having a, an outstanding year. Uh, Johansson coming out after no training camp showing that he has world-class ability. Young players, uh, Alexander Wedberg, who was put into the lineup under trying circumstances and ended up having a very, very uh, a good last portion of the season where he learned to understand our game in North America, playing it for the first time. Mark O'Dano uh, playing on a line with Wedberg and, and uh, the veteran Hartnell developing a line that was really good, fun to watch. Um, we can get into even more of the positive things that uh, we felt happened. I, I know there's things that we want to be better, even though we won our last six at home. Our home record has to be better. Our penalty killing got better, but not good enough. Goals against has to be better. But there was a ton of things that we're going to hang our hat on. And the biggest thing that you have when you go through a season and sometimes um, not reach the playoffs, which is your ultimate goal, is that we at least have a number, and more than just a couple, but a real serious number of things that we can hang our hat on after going through this season.